lot today just listening to these awesome speakers. How about you? But learning, of course, is something that we do what with? We put it into action. So I want to tell you a little bit, kind of a different story here about the company. And that is I want to explain why size matters. Because our company has a great big, you're laughing, what do you think I'm going to say? A great big vision. An amazing vision, because it had the audacity to be the first company to think small. What do I mean by that? Let me give you an analogy. My grandparents listened to music from a gramophone. My parents listened from a record player, as did I. Then CDs. And then iPods. Today, we listen to music anywhere we want by streaming it. And the smaller it became, the more powerful it became. Computers used to take a stage this size to run something that now runs on an iPhone. The smaller it became, the more powerful it became. Size matters, and this company had the audacity to think small that allowed us to take an envelope and go anywhere in the world so that we could play big. It's never been done before, and that is audacious. It takes courage. When Ron first explained power strips and the vision of envelope model, I knew it was either going to be the biggest thing I'd ever touched or the biggest failure I'd ever seen because nobody had done it before. This is an audacious company. Size matters because the company has a very big heart. You see it played out in our community stands. You see it played out by individuals taking action they weren't going to do until they were inspired by seeing others do it. This is a company that is audacious in its commitment to humanity. And I've had the privilege over the last two years, really the honor, to travel all over the world. And I sit in meetings where I don't understand the language. Many times I don't have a translator sitting next to me. And I see people get up in front of that room and with tears in their eyes, they start telling the story about how power strips changed their life. Their mother, their father, their brother, their sister, somebody. And they're standing there and you can feel it. I don't need to know the words because this company has created audacity in the hearts of millions now all over the world. You and I should be damn proud of that. So here's what's going to happen to you. It's happened to many already. I want to talk to the newest people. We have guests that flew in to see who we are. So I want to talk to you for a moment. You are going to have the opportunity at some point to sit in a room like I have, to hear these testimonials. I'm thousands of miles away from home in a language and culture that I don't understand, but I just told you I got it. I get it because it came from right there. Right? And then I thought, if I hadn't told somebody who told somebody, who told somebody else, who told somebody else, maybe 30, 40 iterations of people away from me, that person didn't get to get up and do their testimonial. If you erase yourself from the equation, all of the rest of it dissipates. It never happened unless you had the audacity to make size of your heart matter. Imagine then that if you have that kind of power where somebody gets to get up in front of a room that wouldn't have been there had you not started that chain reaction that ended up with them getting up and telling that story, they wouldn't be there. That makes you and I immensely powerful. So I believe that we are in a business of empowerment. And one of the visions 
that I love about this company is it had the audacity to think small. And here's what I mean by that. Ron originally said, what if, what if it was possible that in some provincial area of the Philippines, some mom or dad who's struggling to figure out how to get food on the table and get their kids a good education so they can break the cycle of poverty, what if they could make $200? $300, $500. I'm not talking about millions. Most people can't think that big. You know what it means for somebody to get up in front of the room and say, because of this company, I made an extra $500 and my kids are going with good shoes to the best school in my province because this company made a difference. So I'm asking you, do not be mild in your thinking. Size matters. Your vision for your life, your vision for your business can only unfold if you unfold it. So I have a principle. People tell, ask me all the time, how'd you become all-star? How'd you become three-star, five-star, six-star? What's the secret? There's got to be a secret, right? Right? Marcia? What's the secret? It's called the Goya principle. You want to know what that means? Get off your... That's the secret, folks. None of the rest happens until we put the Goya principle into action. Get up, show the business, and here's something I want to talk about. We have a company that is crazy good. We've experienced that here. And I hear some people say, you know, I don't like to talk about money. It's not just about the money. And of course money is not everything. Right up there with oxygen, hard to breathe without it, but it's not everything. But let me tell you something. If you want to be an impact player in this company, if you want to be an impact player so that people look you in the eye, and you're going to come to a convention, you're going to go somewhere, somebody's going to come up and tap you on the shoulder and say, I need to introduce myself. You don't know me. But you told James, who told Mary, who told Sally, and now my mom is walking without pain. May I give you a hug? That's what's going to happen for you. They're going to come up and say, if you hadn't done what you did, my financial future, my trajectory would have been just like it was, and it was going nowhere. May I give you a kiss? May I invite you into my home? May I say thank you from the bottom of my heart? You don't know me, but I know you because you got off your butt and you did something. And here's the thing. If you want to be a player and you want to make impact and you don't have a check... You're not helping anybody. It's the scorecard, folks. The bigger the check, the more people you're helping. That's the feedback mechanism that we have that says, I'm an impact player. People are walking this earth better today because the income that I have is a reflection of all the lives that I've helped change. That's who we are. That's what we do. We do it in integrity because this is a company where size matters, the size of our vision, but most importantly, the size of our heart. And I got to tell you, I just got to say, I've got a team with such heart, it's crazy. It's crazy. I feel like an expectant dad because we have somebody who became six star last night and a couple people who are just now, probably within the next hour, will hit seven and all star. How awesome is that? So I'm going to leave you with any tidbit here, my 20 seconds left. It's this. Identify leaders. Take care of them. Get obstacles out of their way. Help them gain the muscle of leadership. And in that process, you gain your own. I was amazed today when I went in and looked at report first thing this morning. In the last 24 hours, this team did over a half a million dollars in 24 hours. 
$500,000, 24 hours, not bad, nice day. But most importantly, again, it's a reflection that people are helping people change their trajectory. That's what we do. That's who we are. Please be audacious with a great big heart. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.